By system preferences we mean the preselection of profiles, hardware and other parameters for specific systems, according to user's standards, or according to project needs. System preferences, are there to make users easier and faster. System preferences can be set either in the user database, and be used as global for all projects, or in the job, as job system preferences. Even if user has already set the system preferences, he can alter them for the job if the requirements are different than the standard ones. In this presentation, we are going to show how to set system preferences in the user database. The procedure is exactly the same for the job system preferences as well. The first pop-up message, informs user that there are some preset preferences in the system database. These are coming with Alumilkal for demonstration reasons, and user should always select no here, otherwise, all his settings will be erased. Select system, for example S77. On first tab, user should set up profile preferences. It's not necessary to fill up all fields, but at least the most common ones. It might happen that for one series there are no profiles in one field. This is because for that series probably the solution is not available. It also might happen, that in some series user will have to choose between more than one selection of the same profile, from a list of what is called auxiliary profiles. These profiles usually ends with, H1, H2, etc. In this case, user should either know from experience which one of these auxiliary profiles is combined with the frame or sash he is going to use, or try one, and check if it working for his typologies with an example. Unfortunately, at this point, software doesn't know what user is constructing, so it can't eliminate the selections of profiles, standard or auxiliary. In case that user wants to preset wall connection, a useful tip is to check the always request bottom at windows. With this selection, user will be asked to add or not wall connection during the creation of the position. For example, for a window, it might needs to have wall connection in bottom, while on a balcony door, or a window installed on zero level, it wouldn't need. For hardware setup, situation is similar with the profiles. User can preset hardware for his most commonly used typologies, and omit the rest. Again, at this point software doesn't know the exact combination of profiles, so user should be careful on selection. If the sash for example is European Groove, the hardware should be the appropriate for European Groove and not for PVC. Of course, in case of wrong selection, this will appear later on position creation, and will be fixed there. Last tab is miscellaneous. Here user should set up details like gasket variants, drainage, corner connectors etc. These are the so-called, position properties. Something important. Fixed glazing from, should remain as no preference, otherwise the default typology, will be the fixed sash typology. Now user can click on save, 
and proceed with next series, or he can click on, apply on current project, and apply these settings on the running project. In the project, system preferences can be changed from menu, job, project preferences, system preferences. With bold, user can see the series that already have set up preferences. By double clicking on any of them, he can alter these preferences. Any change here will be valid only for the current project. So now that we are done with the system preferences, let's make an example with series S77, and check how these presets, together with the project colors and project glass preferences, will help users work be done faster. That's all. So with correct presets and selections, we just created a new position with fixed and tilt and turn insertion in just 39 seconds. That's exactly the purpose of system preferences.